So good morning everybody. I've got a pickup at 7 o'clock in the morning. And it's half hour away. So I've got um, 10 after 6. So that way I've got time to do my circle check. Uh, head on over. Give myself, you know, 15 minutes leeway either way. So that way I've got my pickup time for 7. Now we're going to... Uh, I, uh, Frisbee... Uh, uh, championships from Canada and that's in the south end of Ottawa the address there is uh, uh, 1295 Mantic Station it's called Ultra Parks anyway it's gonna be an extra interesting day so thank you very much and see you in a bit so good morning everybody I'm at 1295 Manatic Station Road and it's Ultimate Championships. It's Frisbee. So yeah, it's a wonderful place here. It's a three days competition and they've got um, food trucks set up. They've got, of course, facilities, you know, washrooms and stuff like that. But it's going to be a fantastic day. So you guys take care and uh, here's the map. All right. Good morning, everybody. So we're uh, doing a three-day charter to Ultra Parks, and that's at uh, 1295 Manatic Station. That's in the south end of the city. Now, uh, it's not well marked right now. It's There's got some flags up, which kind of helps out. So what we're going to do, we're going to take a look around here. And um, this is the field itself. And if you come along Mantic Station Road, you just can whip in. Uh, they have an entrance on this side and an exit on this side. It is, it's pretty well organized, okay? Uh, there is not a lot of space here uh, for cars, um, but the buses come along. We basically get around here. We drop off and go. Uh, they've got um, some food trucks up here. Uh, of course, they've got some uh, porta potties all over the place. Because it is, you know, a giant field. Um, so what they have decided to do, um, they have a shuttle bus um, from St. Mark's High School to the um, to the field. Okay, basically you come along Mantic Station, you get on Mitch Owens, and you turn off at uh, St. Mark's because there's a lot more parking at the high school. That's basically at the end of Line Bank. It's on uh, Duzaos Road. Um, but it's right here. Uh, there is a burger and shake place nearby, but I didn't have time to go there. Um, where we're pulling from, uh, because this is across Canada, this is uh, Frisbee Championships all across Canada, they're staying all over the city. So um, some of the places they're at, uh, they're at the uh, Homewood Suites off of uh, Polanka. They're also at the Hilton Garden near the Ottawa Airport off of Ellert Road. They're also staying at the uh, Carlton U. Uh, they're, it's a it's slightly cheaper there, but they're all over. They're from um, Vancouver, you know, Kamloops. They're from uh, I've seen a couple of groups from Quebec, some from New Brunswick, some from Newfoundland, uh, Toronto, Vancouver. Um, I'm sure I'm going to run into more groups, but they're all over uh, Canada. So they're having a great time. Now, is it organized well? Well, yeah, it's it, there. You know, you've got to adjust on the fly um, because this is something that's kind of, you know, uh, ongoing. Uh, they need a few more buses here, a few more buses there. So it's you know, I've I've done this sort of thing before, and you know what? It's not easy getting, making it perfect, but if you can adjust, hey, it works out. Um, so I've got a bit of a driving video. Basically, I take it from Bank Street all the way over. But you might be coming down Albion. You might be coming down Bozemanville Road. Might be coming down Line Bank. All these work. And uh, just remember when you're turning on to uh, here, uh, at Mantic Station, there is a uh, stoplight. And you're right past the wood source. And you're right beside Baker's uh, General Store. It does work out. Um, so, um, I had a, an extra, I think, two hours 
today. Um, so what I ended up doing, I went and uh, grabbed something to eat up at the end of Earl Armstrong and River Road. There's a Broadway there, and right beside the Broadway, there is a park and ride. So plenty of room for my bus. And I was, you know, 15 minutes away from the rest of the things that were going on. But remember, pay attention, and things might change on the fly. So thank you very much, and here is The Drive. So you've made it to the end of the video. Fantastic. Um, I'm just going to add a little bit of here. Um, what we have, I was looking at Facebook, and uh, they have a Facebook page, Ottawa Carlton Ultimate Association. And uh, if you want to check it out, by all means. And I'd like to take the opportunity to thank all the volunteers. Uh, we tend to forget uh, how many hours are put into making these things happen. And it's easy to say you know, it wasn't perfect, but you know what? I've been in, involved in these things an awful lot, and it's not easy. And, you know, uh, so long as things happen and we try to adjust, it, it does work out. And uh, hats off to them. They, You know, I think they're doing a fantastic job because there's an awful lot involved in something like this. So I hope you enjoy the good weather in Ottawa. And I hope that uh, the rest of the uh, tournament goes well. And I'll be seeing you uh, tomorrow. So you guys, um, well, well job, well, well done job. Uh, I'm going to take a little opportunity to, to plug my uh, YouTube channel. Um, the reason why I did this originally, um, a lot of our veteran drivers were um, retiring. And uh, I found that Yes, we train our bus drivers to pick up kids and bring them to school. But charters are a different beast. You know, it's it's a learn-as-you-go process. And what I've decided to do is I, I, I make these videos because I was getting a lot of questions in person, uh, over the radio. Um, you know, sometimes people would text me, ask me, where do I park, what do I do, things like that. So I decided, well, I'm going to try doing a YouTube video. 
And um, because although Google Maps is a wonderful tool, it it's for cars, okay? It doesn't really work well for buses at times. So I put a camera in the front and I do a little map section and sometimes I'll go around filming. Now I try very hard not to film kids and if I do I try to edit it out or make it so far distance that you can't tell who it is. And um, I, I try to do this for bus drivers and teachers and when the bus drivers find my channel and the teachers find my channels they're, they're thrilled because you know, it, it answers so many questions that, you know, uh, what goes on there? Is there anything close by? Can I get something to eat? Can I, you know, can I use the facilities? Questions like that that don't usually come up. So the channel itself is doing well. I've got over 44,000 views, uh, over a 1,000 hour watch times. So I, I need a few more subscribers. Uh, I got an award from the Transportation Board, so that's good. And I enjoy myself doing these things because sometimes I'm, you know, I'm stuck at a location where, what am I going to do for an hour and a half, you know? So that's why I decided to start trying to do this. And uh, you know what? It's, it's uh, rewarding. So you guys take care and thank you very much. And uh, see you in my bus. Bye.